by the Goenchi Lara and all the amazing artists. Goenchi Lara, of course, you're uh, gracious. Thank you very much and your cast for an amazing performance. Folks, we use the word masala in many contexts when it comes to our own terminology, Konkani terminology. So masala, you could say, some of you may not like the performance and say, hey, you know, and it's Viva Goa Fest, Samke Masala. Or you may say, you know, Selvin put a lot of masala and he spoke about the fundraiser. Uh, or, we have the masala in a going traditional weddings, we in music. The next one is a different kind of masala. And we have Lizette Saldana from here in Canada, who's going to speak, who's going to do a demonstration. Lizette grew up here in Canada and her mother raised her to be deep in love with Goa and the Goan food. So she's an ardent foodist, uh, foodie. Uh, so over the years, Lizette has found ways to simplify some of those more cumbersome or complex Goan recipes in a busy lifestyle. I think I've also personally seen some the dolls she makes in a microwave. So uh, those who are into microwave the dolls, you can reach out to Lizette. But having said that, she Lizette has her own uh, cooking blog and we encourage everyone to enjoy the unique and encourages everyone to enjoy the unique taste of Goan cooking. So I'm going to bring Lizette online for a few minutes to talk about Goan masala. Hey, Selvin. And hey, Lizette. Hi. How are you doing? Sorry. I just asked you how are you doing. Not very much. 
brush is coming out of this bottle. It's got a very small hole at the top. Mm -hmm. So there you go. It's a little bit of paste. I hope you can see it. All right. So at this stage, you can smell the uh, reishad masala. You start to, to enjoy the uh, smells of your gone kitchen. And you're ready to go. At this stage, you can go ahead and stuff fish or whatever you have in the kitchen that you want to prepare for your meal. But I have another ingredient that I usually use. And... Um, this is optional, but my mother always used it in her kitchen, and I'm going to share it with you. So that's about, what I add to this is about a teaspoon to two teaspoons of uh, tomato paste. Okay, and I'm going to mix that in.